What's up guys, it's your boy Javon Stunner and I've got some more iPhone accessories to share with you today. Um, as you can see, my iPhone is naked again, so we will just sit that off to the side. Actually, I'll sit it on top of my computer and we'll go over a couple things. Uh, one of the things that we've got today to show you is called uh, Shield Skin and it's, uh, this is the website for the company. Uh, and this is just an alternative product supposedly to uh, the Invis Invisible Shield uh, line. And uh, on the back it says, don't scratch it, skin it. And it just talks about what the company is all about. Thin, strong, uh, super strong, scratch resistant, invisible film. Uh, custom designed to fit the entire body um, of the device. Uh, and let's see if there's anything else that you guys really care about. <laughs> here uh, it's supposed to be military grade blah 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 and contents of this package are well, let's see a skin I'm trying to read this without glare off of the LCD um, the skin application instructions application solution and a squeegee card so let's open this up and see what's in here and it comes in this kind of generic packaging but it it is packaged pretty uh, professionally. Um, it's just not like the big official box that you get when you buy the Invisible Shield product. You know, you get. Let me move my camera for a second. See if I've actually got a box for an Invisible Shield anywhere. You get. Yeah, I do. For an Invisible Shield, you get this big massive box. That has all the 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 that that's just product placement, and for this other product you get this little paper. So I'm not gonna hold that against them. Um, right here you've got some sort of gel application, and it says on it installation gel. Check. Uh, we've got a better squeegee than for a phone case for a phone cover installation in my opinion than what comes with the invisible shield that's a kind of a bigger more cumbersome squeegee but I do like this uh, it's a uh, nice thick plastic and uh, you've got the actual products in some sort of uh, shrink wrapped material I guess this is like some sort of shrink, shrink wrap plastic so that's no good. I wish they'd have just put the covers in the case because you run the risk of damaging the covers just trying to get them out of this extra set of package, which I'm not happy about. Um, one thing that's interesting about this particular one is this is a full body cover. So that's something that uh, I hadn't actually used before. Um, and you've got, that's the back. I can tell because if you catch the light just right, you can see the the camera hole right here. So this is the back. This should be the front. Yep. And it looks pretty good. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Um, I don't know. It looks better than my smudge proof front, but it does look pretty good. And here are the sides. That's the button size, as you can see, kind of sort of there. That's the top and no bottom. But there's the, you see the button top there. It's kind of hard to show a reflection on this thing, but you get the picture. There's the button for the sleep weight button. So yeah, um, I'm going to be installing this. I'll let you guys know what I think. Um, I really don't want to lose my my smudge proof because it's been great um, for me, and it, it it doesn't take away from the phone that much. But you know, this is all about trying different stuff, and you know if if I end up having issues, I will go back to the smudge proof, and you know I'll go that route. Uh, the other product that I have here is of course another case um, and this is a knockoff case from the vapor which was a very popular iPhone a uh, very popular iPhone 4 case I believe 4 4s case and it's here's some of the smaller pieces it's got a, a sleep wake button there 
um, another wrench, got a couple extra screws. Uh, it also came with protectors uh, to the tune of three screen protectors. So I've got screen protectors out of my ears now. Um, and this case looks really good. Um, it's got that big arm and it's got a nice grip. It's got a SIM card slot, volume slots, uh, sleep wake button, and a nice big opening for uh, lightning port and speakers and what's cool about this one is is that it does not cut into your hands if you hold it from the bottom and I hold my phone very weird um, when I talk I generally hold it with my pinky securing it so I don't drop it because I'm just you know a weirdo like that and I hold it like this and then I can now control all of my ports sleep wake and then I have a pinky like that so I just generally you know bounce my hand around it but this this case seems very solid and I went with black they have a lot of colors to offer um, I went with black uh, because I just thought you know ultimately that it was uh, the the lesser of two evils with my particular phone um, I will not put the link in the description. I know I said I was going to do that last time. And the reason I'm not going to put the link in there is because there's not just one. Um, there's just a general search that you can do to find these particular items. Um, and like I like I said in the, in the last uh, metal uh, iPhone case video, all you need to do in order to find these uh, items is go to search what I just what I put down there and if you search it you'll get a ton of results and then I generally refine my search to US only uh, because I live in the US if you live in the you know UK or, or wherever you live you might want to refine your search to that area so that you'll have the best search results if you're trying to get the product fast um, my desk is a mess guys right now you see these wires and stuff everywhere is because I am in the process of changing my setup yet again and um, like I said you guys don't you know probably don't change your setup that often um, I do because I'm constantly looking for what's going to work best with my workflow so I tweak all the time and you know this was just I, I did some more tweaks in the last couple days uh, to make this area more usable more user friendly for me um, and you know you guys will do what you need to do to make the desk <laughs> make your your computer desk more user friendly for yourself oh I almost lost the script um, yeah so this guy just basically pops in here like so on the rail system and uh, actually before I get that far, let's pop the button in. The button's like stuck. <laughs> Little button goes in there. And we'll pop it in and see what we got. Rail system. And this is pretty much it. Uh, I need to. I'm trying to look at this, guys. Hold on. Let me screw this back together for you, real quick. Actually, I'm not going to screw it together because I'm going to put the screen protector and stuff on. I'll show you the finished product once it's done. But All right, guys, so check it out. I was finally able to get the cover on, and as you can see, it looks really good. Uh, it's very, very similar. So it's basically a direct knockoff of the vapor case um, by Element, but I'm, I'm really happy with it. Uh, it looks good all around, and it fits well. It's got, and if we, let me push in, it's got two screws in the side here. And then it's also got a couple screws in the top. And I, I decided to go ahead and keep my smudge proof invisible shield on the front. But on the rear, I went with their cover because with the, the new cover that I showed you earlier, which was the uh, shield skin. And I, I like it. And I also put it, it's, it's going all around the top and the sides, just not on the bottom. Um, and if you look here, you can just make out that is there um, it's in that little crevice there you can kind of see where it, it is right around this button 
and it's full uh it, and it hit pretty good um in the in the short amount of time um you know i've heard a lot of people had issues with this particular uh case or uh, with one similar to it um I hadn't had any issues so far. Um, I always get one bar in my house, so I hadn't got anything uh, less than that. I was able to complete calls so far. I'm going out here in a few minutes to eat with my wife, so I'll get opportunity to test it out. And um, I'll let you guys know um, if anything changes. Otherwise, you know, if you don't hear from me about this particular case, consider it all good. Uh, it does add a little bit of weight to the phone, which I'm actually not all that upset about because the phone was so light so it feels about like an iPhone 4s with uh, this cover on but I mean what I do like is it doesn't cut it to my finger as I told you earlier I, I have like a a crazy way to hold the phone I, I hold it like this it's not cutting into my fingers I can get to all of my ports really easily and still you know bounce back and forth and feel comfortable with the phone um, which was not the case with the which was not the case uh, this is not a play on words with the last case that I reviewed for you guys. Um, this is a great case. It's nice looking. Uh, if I had, and I don't have the screws in it, but uh, I don't actually even need that part to show you this. Um, this part at the bottom will cut into your finger. So if you hold the phone the way I hold it, pretend my fingers is the iPhone. Um, this where this dips in this point and this point will slice your fingers so that was one of the parts I wasn't happy about with that case but in this particular model it's smooth all the way around no edges and uh, except where I can grip it and I feel confident with it while um, holding this particular case and like I said this the screen protector looks great so if you guys are in need of a screen protector and you don't want to do the invisible shield, hit these guys up um, and know they're not paying me for this. Uh, shield skin with a S, shieldskins.com and uh, check them out. Um, I don't know how long it'll last, but uh, prices was prices were good. It's like 18 or it might have been 15 bucks for this for a full body cover for an iPhone 5. It feels good to the touch. Um, and I'm, I'm happy with my combination I have right now. As always, let me know uh, what phone combination you're rocking. I'm thinking about going after one of those Grove cases next. That's the all wood case. I'll let you guys know um, in the video if I do decide to get one. But uh, at least for today, I'll be rocking this case. That's all I got. Thank you so much. Peace.